Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Penumbra. I know what I gotta do now. I gotta make a bridge out of crates. Doesn't seem too hard. This should be relatively easy, actually, first of all. Put that one to the wall. Pull this one out a little bit. Roughly with a jumping range. Things are somehow light enough to be carried by water, but too heavy for me to pick up and move. Alright. That's the end of it. That should work. Looks pretty good. Alright, let's head up. Let's keep this glow stick out just in case everyone else can't see. Cause that's pro that's a pretty high possibility. Okay, at the bottom of the circle. Another puzzle passed. Exit. I'd love to get out of here. Alright, let's go. through a sewer to get here. Yes, I have. I suppose I'm flattered. Hi, I'm Amabel, Amabel Swanson, and I suppose I'll be your guide for the day. Hello, can you hear me? Yes. I think the transmission's only one way. I've got a webcam. Pull a silly face if you can hear me. Oh, very attractive. <laughs> okay, we're on. Okay. There's some things you need to know. 
We released a virus. Right. It wiped us out. Three weeks ago, we tried to get out through the mines, but it didn't work the way we'd planned. I think one of the Inuit workers made it, but others were taken. Some panicked and got lost. I ran, and when I stopped, I was on my own. Oh, and another symptom is deja vu. Okay. The only chance we have is a man called Howard. He said he'd found a solution to the virus. His vitals last registered in the library, but only members of the organization have access. I'm still seeing Me. a few life signs in the residential quarter. You need to find a survivor and get through into the library. Oh, and look out for our medical guy, Richard Eminis. He was acting strangely when I last saw him. Well, he's infected. Hmm. What else don't you know? Let's see. Watch out for signs of infection. Did, did you say something? Look, the symptoms we know about are paranoia and oral distortion. Oh, and another symptom is deja vu. All right. Enough already. My sides are splitting. Well, I think that's everything you need to know. I'm sending over some research on the virus, and I'll get some doors open for you. Maybe now we can shoot the ship. All right. Close document. Might need that later. All right, let's get out of here. Infected, I'd skip a beat when I heard that word in association with me. Still, it seemed like just one more reason to find my father. Hearing a friendly voice hadn't hurt either, but by that point, I was pretty certain she'd turn out to be crazy. Makes sense. Most friendly people you meet in horror games turn out crazy eventually. If we must continually share this brain space, I think I should have a name. Strange. So rare an opportunity to select one's own nomenclature, and yet I find myself at a loss. Huh. Any ideas, monkey? Your name will be Potato. So much storage in this mind of yours. Did you realize you got an entire section in here devoted to film titles? 3,103 and a half. Films you've seen? Yep. You only got the first half of It's a Wonderful Life in here. Oh, how does it end? Now I'll never know. Yep. I. You know, stupid. Clarence. That's not a bad handle. I am something of a guardian angel. Fine, your name's Clarence, and I'll stop fucking with my eyes. That was annoying. Like, really annoying. Looks like we might have to kill someone. Oh, this place is well lit for a horror film. Horror game, I should say. It looks... Sheet of paper behind the glass, but maybe I can get it out. Uh, can I open up any of these? All of them. Good. Let's look through all of them meticulously and try to find something of use. Come on now. Be useful. Be useful. We have a dude in our head named Clarence. Armory. I like the sound of that. Boxes of em empty ammunition boxes. Give me a gun. There's just something about a rusty saw that just makes me purr. Had a tetanus jab recently.
Oh, shite! Sup, bro? Go away. I don't like you. Well, you're kind of... Well, you're not the sharpest knife in the drawer, are you? Can I use the not? Can I use the saw on him? Nope, can't. And I believe he's also naked, so I may have to censor that. Screw you! I don't like you. When I find a way to kill you, you're fucking dead. may not be scary, but it's really fucking weird. Go away! Nope, he's still on my ass. Well, while this is going on, at least I can think. Oh! You gotta be shitting me. out these lights so I can hide better. Looks like someone drained out the munitions. It would be nice to have a gun. No one's there. Nothing. Nothing at all. Go away. I don't like you. Even that's got me a little geeked. Just the thrill of getting caught. Can I lure him into that area? I'm pretty well hidden right now. I'm very well hidden. I'd like to thank you all very, very much for watching, and please tune in next time for Let's for Let's Play Penumbrum Black Plague. Subscribe if you like my videos. I make videos every day and post. Well, okay, I post videos every day, and 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 try my best to be as entertaining as possible. But uh, anyway, I'll see you next time, guys. Maybe we'll sneak past that monstrosity.